Hey everyone, I'm going on the hunt today. I've got my list. I'm going to visit three different places. Go for the 50p bins. My challenge to myself is nothing but 50p comics. So I'm going plowing through the cheap list, see if I can find some things on my on my lists. And I might pick up some backing boards as well because I'm a bit short on those. Uh, but yeah, stay tuned to see what I pick up. Can he make a comic feed? Yes, he can. He just did. Watch now a video from Grey Man. A video from Grey Man. So I'm in Walthamstow, Black Horse Lane. Behind these uh, standard music venue, it used to be a standard music venue, it's now it's an empty building. It's not been done nothing with it for decades, but I used to put gigs on here back in the, I don't know, mid 90s, was it? I can't remember, late 90s. So about three years, every Monday night we put gigs on, including like all day, I was on bank holidays. Bands like Benediction, uh, Deranged from Sweden, uh, Vomitory, Gorotti, lots of bands come and play down here, so that was cool. Anyway, my comic shop's just down the road. Okay, so here's my comic shop for my first. 50p hunt, Krypton comics and Wolfenstein. All those boxes down by the window, there's about 20 odd boxes, all 50p each. Normally it's a load of crap, but let's see what I can pick up today. Okay, so that's part one of my three part shopping trip sorted. Home for lunch, bag of knickknacks and a pork pie. <laughs> let's show you what I picked up. First off, I got I actually paid for some backing boards. Because the ones that I get second hand ones, they're a bit, they're a bit tatty, and uh, yeah, I thought I'd just pay for them from now on. Right now, I managed to pick up a lot of some of these two, two issues of a, a James Bond comic. It's both parts of it, so I thought well, for a pound for two, you know, the fifty, all these are fifty p each. Then I saw this Steve and Mrs. Pill, a TV program, The Avengers I used to like as a kid. The original Avengers, I think, before the uh, Marvel Comics Avengers. I think so, I think it predates it, I'm not too sure though. But the weird thing is, this one says number one of six. And then it goes on two of three and three of three. So I was wondering if there was a, a, a six part and a three part. But no, it just seems to be uh, one three part. But the first one is, is not properly uh, marked up. And sticking with that, I've managed to find zero, one... Two, <laughs> three, four, five, six, and seven of, I'm um, assuming, an ongoing series. Uh, initial ones were written by Mark Wade, so, and the Avengers were a good quirky TV show. I used to love this as a kid. Um, started off thinking black and white, and then it went to the new Avengers in colour, and they were all good stuff. But I've got a Night Thrasher for my run. Got a couple missing from the Night Thrasher run. A couple of Iron Man that I didn't have in my run, so that's cool. And a 50p one, so the condition is not brilliant. This one's got a bit of a scuffed back corner, but uh, that's fine. A <laughs> uh, rather tatty looking X-Man. It's even got like a black stain over the back of it and like, a couple of stickers on the front. But uh, I've never had this one in my collection. Now I do. <laughs> this one was quite cool. Uh, so a Conan like special or something, uh, Red Nails, that's a, I think that's the original book, an original Conan book, uh, art by, uh, Roy, uh, sorry, by Roy Thomas and Barry Windsor Smith, so a classic duo, Roy Thomas did so many great stuff and uh, Barry Windsor Smith was a, a much beloved Conan writer, I'm, uh, sorry art artist, right so more for my star brand run, five, six, Seven, eight, thirteen is that, and fourteen. So that's cool. So not too bad on the Star Brand run. There are quite a lot of Legion of Superheroes from this run. I'm pretty sure. Um, the trouble is with this run, I haven't got it properly written down on my uh, on my list. Uh, I'm pretty sure. No, <laughs> I hope none of these are doubles. If they were, they cost me fifty p. I'll, I'll I'll live with it. Yeah. Twenty-five, twenty-seven, fifty-four, fifty-eight, fifty-nine, sixty. So that's a few for my Legion Superheroes. Because the trouble with the Legion Superheroes, so many different runs. It gets a bit confusing sometimes for them. Right, a few from my Nomad run. Seven, 
it's one of those ones that I, I, I picked up a few of them at the time and somehow, you know, some are missing. So I'm sort of filling in the gaps in, in that. Uh, this one, this cover's so familiar. I was sure I had this one. I literally, I checked my list like three times going, this is so familiar. I must have this, surely. But it was on my list as not being currently owned by me. So I picked it up. <laughs> a nice quirky Marvel team up. But well, I mean, it's fine. I'm actually going uh, Spectacular Spider-Man. I'm going from 100 onwards, but this is number 99. So it's like, well, when I think about it, you've got to start with, I put back, back and front mine in the bag. So I need 99 to go in front of 100. So <laughs> this has now been added to the, 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 the run that I'm after. Right, uh, 103 of Spectacular Spider-Man. And 104 of Spectacular Spider-Man. So, well happy with that. Well, I'm also working on a future present for my nephew. Um, oh, this is a tatty one. I didn't realise that when I told... Oh, I'm sure there was... Oh, I should look this one a bit better. Never mind. It's a bit tatty at the top there. I did, I saw the, the, the turned corner, but it's a bit moth-eating at the bloody top of the comic. Never mind. So these are just for... I'm just, gonna, I'm just trying to get him a Captain Atom run together, basically. That's all I'm doing. I managed to pick up, someone was selling number one for like 50p or something, and I thought, well, bloody hell, that's a really good run, Captain Adam. I can't believe number one's only 50p. And I was like, yeah, sorry, I, I sort of started to, <laughs> it's quite a long run, so it may take me a, a while to get it together. Uh, but yes, it's pretty, cost me, even at 50p each, it's gonna cost me a fair bit. But uh, yeah, I'll see what I can do about getting him this run for his birthday or something. So there you go. And that's everything I got in that first shop. I'm annoyed I never noticed the top. If I'd noticed the top on this one, I wouldn't have picked it up. Never mind. <clears throat> that's it then. I'm going to be out after I've eaten my lunch. I'm going to nip out to Romford. Uh, the shop that was in, um, I've mentioned it before, it was in Upminster and it moved. For, uh, literally, I, I, I realised there was a shop there, managed to go to it once. And then it moved. <laughs> He's the guy who also put on that uh, sort of like mini con that I went to as well in uh, in Upminster. So he's moved to Romford, which is not maybe that easy for me to get to. I'm not really too sure uh, on how to get there. Uh, but you know, I'll have to look it up and work it out. And uh, I'll go from there to another guy who's, I know there's a bus from Romford that goes to this place, this guy's house. He's uh, a Facebook seller. And he's got like some 50p books, bat boxes, and uh, I've, I'm picking up a Defenders for, from him as well. So I'm going to look for his 50p boxes, see if there's anything decent in there. And uh, maybe even look in his pound boxes if I can't find anything decent in his 50p boxes. <laughs> we'll see. Anyway, I'll be back later to show you what else I picked up. Okay, so I'm at a bus stop now. I've just been to the second shop. I forgot to do any filming when I was in there because I had a bit of a hard time finding the place. <laughs> and when I found it, I forgot to do any filming, which is annoying because a bloke in there probably wouldn't let me film inside as well. I should have thought, but oh, never mind. I was too busy chatting. But uh, I'm off to this third place that I'm going to now. There's a bloke who sells on Facebook and he's got some 50p bins that I was going to go through. Uh, I've had a right mare with the traffic, well, with all the traffic, well, with the uh, buses. I was on the wrong side of the road and I couldn't find where to cross the road because it's like a dual carriageway. And like I walked all the way down to try to find some lights on one side, all the way down to try and find some lights on the other side, I couldn't see them. Eventually found a subway, uh, eventually. No signs for it that I could see. Anyway, and now a bus that I wanted has just gone past without stopping. So yeah, it's all, all good fun. <laughs> anyway, I'll show you what comics I got later. All right, so let me show you what I got from the second shop. Right, this was a last minute grab as I was going out actually, because I'd accidentally bought um, <laughs> two of the same comic in the shop. I made my two of the same comic, I noticed. Uh, and uh, he said, quickly grab another one. So yeah, I grabbed this one before I went out, X-Men 190. These were um, not 50p ones, some of these. These Titans have been sort of holding on for me. I always get confused with the Titans, the blinking um, volume one and volume two, and it kind of gets confusing looking at my list, what ones I've got, what ones I haven't. Especially when I look at covers, and I think to myself, I've got that one, because the covers seem so familiar. But when I go for my, my um, collection, I don't have that one. So I don't know what made me think I did have that. You know, so that happens a few times with these Titans. But these ones were um, not too expensive. I forgot what I paid for this lot now. <laughs> All right. So they're just reader copies, you know, they're not in the most immaculate condition, but they're good enough for me. I'm not going to show them for too long because I've got a lot of uh, comics to show off. Right, this one was a nice 50p, Cemetery Beats. I've got a few of these already, so this 
wasn't on my list, but I had a feeling I knew I hadn't got that one. Right, and finally finished off this run of Judge Dredd. I bought this when it came out from, uh, you know, in my local um, comic shop, but you never put this one in my box for some reason. So that's Judge Dredd. And I've got a few Dark Hawk. Closing in on the Dark Hawk run. Right, a couple of uh, new warriors. Getting this run nearly finished now. I'm not sure how long the run went on for actually. I'm not sure if I'm going for the full run or just for up to a certain number. I'm not too sure. But this one, I couldn't resist this one. It's not on my list or anything. It was just so daft and it was only 50p. And I'm like, oh, I'm tempted just because of, the, because of the craziness of it. Right. <laughs> it's mint condition, but it's actually got a hole going all the way through it. <laughs> you can see. It's got a bullet hole going all the way through the comic. Every single page of the comic, it's got, it's got, yeah, you see my finger. <laughs> it's got a bullet hole going all the way through it. That is, uh, that is just craziness. I just had to pick that up just for the, just for the sheer audacity of a comic with a bullet hole going all the way through it from, from the front. <laughs> I'm repeating myself for four times there, but you, you get the gist. There's a bullet hole going all the way through it. <laughs> a couple from my fly run. Uh, closing in on that now, 7 and 14. A uh, few more Nomads. These ones weren't 50p actually, but I got a, he gave me a deal on them. He always knocks a bit of money off as well, so I think these are... It was like you get the £2 each or you get free for a fiver. So, and then he adds them up, then he knocks a bit off, and then he uh, gets to the final amount and he knocks some more off kind of thing. <laughs> I've nearly finished this Nomad run now. This is the one I nearly had two of. <laughs> All right. So those are the ones I picked up from the second shop. So most of them were 50p. And I ended up starting a new run just because I saw these going. I was like, oh, I haven't got this one of Hawkman. And I was like, oh, sorry, I'm gonna bloody buy these 50p each. I think there's 17 in this series. Uh, if I manage to find a few more in the 50p bins, it won't have cost me too much, you know? And they are nice Hawkman comics. Right, then for the third shop, I think I might have mentioned this already, I had to get a bus and I didn't know when, I didn't know the area at all. I was on the wrong side of the road and it was a really busy um, dual carriageway and there was no way, I couldn't see any, oh, another thing he gave me in another shop, he gave me a, a magnet. X-Men <laughs> Magnet, he just gave it away to me. Anyway, I think I told you this in the video already, but eventually um, I, I got to the next place. The guy was on his way home from work and he met me after work uh, by the bus stop near his house. And uh, yeah, went through his 50p's and uh, one pound bins. Basically what money I had left from my budget, I, I spent there. And he, again, he threw in a couple of comics, he took a couple off, you know, so I, I probably ended up getting better. Then you know what I've done. He threw this one in for free. It's just the, he actually gave me two free comics just because they were all ratty and they were just there. He just gave them to me. And I actually gave one of them to a little girl on the way home. I was on the train on the way home. It was a little uh, Looney Tunes um, comic. I probably would have quite enjoyed it to it myself, but she was sitting there looking a bit bored. So I thought, oh, no, I'll give it. I'll give her that free comic that I've picked up. And um, yeah, she seemed. Really, she seemed more interested in looking at the adverts than she did in the comic, but she was quite young. So, you know, hopefully she'll grow up and remember that ugly bearded man who gave her a comic when she was four or whatever. <laughs> and she'd, you know, click loads of comics. Anyway, who, who knows? Right, I've got some more Captain Atom for my nephew. Trying to get him a Captain Atom run together. Uh, pretty sure I'll probably be able to pick up most of this run, 50p each. I'm saying that, it's still going to work out about 50 quid. Oh, treat them too nicely. Because <laughs> he's the only one of my relatives who likes comics. So, right, this one I think was a £2 one. Super Boys from Moran. There you go. Silver Surfer 102. Right, a nice old flash. Ah, he saved every one of us. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Power pack number 21. A 
Power Man and Iron Fist. The funny thing is with this guy, I was going there because I put it down for a Defenders comic I wanted. Defenders number two. Well, not Defenders number two, but it was £2 for a Defenders comic. And he had some 50p pins. I said, go for his 50p pins, pick up the comic for him. And he couldn't find the comic. And I couldn't remember what number it was. But I ended up coming down with lots of comics anyway. Right, a few more for my uh, Marvel 2 ones. Always cool. Believe it or not, I started collecting comics just after the crisis, so I don't have all the crises. I have about, I think I have like two or three comics of the crisis. I've got Death of Flash. I haven't got Death of Supergirl, uh, so I'm, I've kind of got them on my list. If I see them going cheap, I'll pick up the crisis run. Uh, I dare say Death of Supergirl is expensive, but they're number 12, only 50p. Got a Conan as well. I've got a feeling this might be a double now. I think I want to look to my list. Oh well. Legionnaires. Trying to get this little modern run together, uh, the unexpected. I might try and get all of these because um, they're, they're, they're going pretty cheap now, 50p in there. Like, was it Brimstone, Silencer, uh, Sideways? I picked up a few silencers before. But I also tried to pick up this new 52 Earth 2 because I had a few already and I keep seeing the other one around here and there. And if I can get a 50p each, then you know, why not have that Earth 2 story? It's pretty self-contained, so. Right, this is X Factor, 148. Right, I managed to pick up a few of these Fate that I didn't have. Got a cup of tea, because <laughs> I had quite a, quite a busy day, I suppose, traveling around, walking about, trying to find places. Still got to do what I did here. Yeah, so I've got most, quite a lot of these fates all finished up. And then finally, the last one, another one of my impact comics for the Sh Legend of Shield. So yeah, pretty happy with that. Got quite a few comics here. Let's see, I just, just want to count these to see how much they get. One, one, two. Yeah, okay. Just want to count them. They worked out less than the pound each anyway. Still worked out less than the pound each, even though a couple of them were two pounds. So that's cool. I think it can be free for a fiver as well. So something like that. So that's cool. All good. All good. Uh, yeah, so quite happy. Filled a few off my list. Still got plenty to go. Still got pages and pages to go, but you see it's nice when you've got you know, a few crossed off. So anyway, I'm out of here. Thanks for watching. Thanks for checking out my latest cheapo haul. <laughs> uh, it could be a long time now before I get any more. Must not get any more for ages. Yes, I keep saying this, but it's true. Unless you want to send me lots of money so I can, so I can you know, carry on spending like a madman. <laughs> right, let me shout out a little channel as well. Right, uh, I want to shout out G Dub Comics. G Dub Comics is a new guy, I think. Uh, not got too many subs, as all these ones that I shout out haven't got that many subs. Uh, I, I think I, I don't know if I just subbed him recently. I would have watched at least one of his videos to to know about him to mention it, but I can't remember what I saw of his. I can't remember if he's got any particular series. I think he's just haul videos, like you know most of us do. But his link's going to be up in the corner, down below. So give him a sub as well. If you're looking for a new person to, you know, to welcome into the comic community, to give them a little bit of support, you know, then uh, go sub. G-dub. I'm out of here. And until next time, may all your news be good news.